welcome back to the channel and welcome to the first coffee of the month for 2020 and what a beauty coffee we have got to kick off the new year so january is a bit of a weird time for everybody just getting over christmas getting back to work but for the coffee world some amazing coffees are landing and we have gone for an exceptional coffee from rwanda we have gone for rwanda Buenda. So we didn't go for a Rwandan coffee last year. Coffees come in in January from Rwanda and from Burundi and last year we decided to go for a, a coffee from Burundi but we love Rwandan coffees at Rowan Coffee so this year after cupping this coffee we just knew we had to share it with everybody. So a little bit about this coffee it is from the south of Rwanda it is grown at 1700 meters above sea level, it is a red Bourbon variety and it is washed and it is tasting awesome. So without further ado, let's have a smell. Oh, because we didn't get a Rwandan coffee last year I forgot how amazing they actually are. And they just have that real sweet chocolatey depth some really fruity notes coming through on the nose as well on the dry. I just need to get some water on this. A little bit of background on Buenda. So this is the first container lot of coffee that has come from this processing mill. It was only a container's worth that was picked and processed. So we're fortunate enough to get our hands on this coffee. And the wet mill is in place because it's helping out farmers who are somewhat isolated so they have to travel very long distances to their closest wet mill. Now really what you need to do with coffee cherries is you want to get them handed over on the day, you want to get them pulped, fermented, washed, ready for drying as quickly as possible to get the best quality and obviously we know the better quality the coffee, the higher premiums the farmers, the small holders can get for their coffees. So we're really happy that we're supporting this coffee and the results are outstanding. So I think we should dig into this coffee. Um, let's have a sip. It's just so clean. You can tell it's been processed really well. Um, the acidity is really sharp, it's up front, it's sort of cranberry, rhubarb -y sort of acidity coming through but it's balanced out by the depth of the cup so it's really rich, dark chocolatey, quite a heavy body on the cup um, but that acidity really punches through and it's so well balanced and well rounded, it's just an absolutely exceptional coffee. Yeah, that acidity is just absolutely beautiful, but it's not overpowering the cup. Because the coffee is so well processed and so well balanced with the body and the richness and the acidity and the sweetness, you just get a full mug of deliciousness really. Um, I'm really happy with this coffee, I'm really happy with the way it's come out, I'm happy with the way we've roasted it, I think we've done it justice. Um, if you're a subscriber this coffee will have landed on your doorstep last week so hopefully you're enjoying it as much as we are at the roastery. But what an awesome coffee to kick off 2020. There's still a sack left we're going to be roasting it throughout February as well, so it's online. Grab yourself a bag while you can before it disappears. But it's extremely delicious, full of acidity, full of complexity. And I just want to say thanks for watching. Stay focused.